welcome back to GP's Odds and Ends. Jessica here. So we will be doing some Sunday Sunflower Savings Challenges today. I feel like it's been forever um, since I've done any of this. I don't know where I am in some of these uh, envelopes. I think there's some new ones in there. Where I'm going to be using $100 today, so 10, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 80, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90, 91, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 100. Okay, so... Um, yeah, I just, I feel like it's been forever since I've done, like, the savings challenges or, like, any of this stuff, really. And it looks like from the paper clip we left off last time with the support small, um, envelopes. So let's just get right into it. Uh, this one is from Liz and Les says, yes, you can. Consistency, not perfection. So this was like a thank you uh, card that came with a purchase. So let's see. Since I have a little bit extra, should I maybe like do $10 worth? Get rid of a couple of these fives. Hmm. What's this envelope for support small? Let's do five for now and see if we come back around to it or not. And I'm just going to need to make sure that that is dried off before I put it back into the envelope. <laughs> and this whole binder comes from Janelle Ray Budgets as well. Okay, so next up is the giveaway envelope, and this one is folded in half. This one's from Snow Gardener Budgets three, Snow Gardener three hundred seven Budgets, and let's see, I have how much would it take to finish this one? Because I have let's see, one dollars, two, two, and one, so two, four, six, no, two, four, five, and six dollars. Hmm, should I finish this one? It'll be one, three, five, six dollars. Let's do it. I mean, this one was a small one anyways, but um, this one was only $25 total. That's Okay, so this should be 25, 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Okay, so this is going into giveaways. I do have a giveaway going on right now. So if you did not watch all the way to the end of my Etsy payout, go check it out. Watch till the end. There's a question that you need to answer in order to... Enter and, you know, <laughs> it will be closing soon. I think I have it running until um, like the 22nd maybe is the last. No, I'm not putting that back in there. What am I doing? Is the last day that you would be able to enter and then I'll announce on the 23rd, I think it is, or whatever that Wednesday is. So I'll need to find another one if we come back around to that envelope but next up is sweet and sassy budgets this snowy spots and i need a scratch token let's see what we have so that's three uh let's do one more six So that's nine total, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. And actually, you know what? <laughs> I don't know why I just did that. I'm gonna put 
a dollar back in and put in a 10. Just makes it easier. Okay, and this would be going towards clothes, which I do need. I mean, winter is coming. I, I need to switch clothes over soon, probably. It's actually been, the weather's been weird here. It's like the middle of October. It's been cold like the last week, and now it's getting back up into like the 70s again. Like, what? <laughs> it's happening. Um, but it, it's just weird. So we have like windows open right now because it's just so nice and warm outside. But I, I don't know when it's going to get cold again. But I mean, I'm wearing a flannel still. I, I don't know. <laughs> but I do also like because I did join a gym, so I do need some extra like workout clothes. I did order some, so I did pull money from my Soul Mama binder and put it in the bank to pay for that already. Um, just because like I, I don't really have that many like workout clothes, like leggings and just like you know t-shirts or whatever that I could wear to uh, the gym. So I needed to to get some more. Uh, let's see. Should I finish off the fours? Five, six, seven, and eight. Why not? So five, six, seven, and eight. Has anybody, anybody been watching like any of the spooky stuff, uh, spooky season Halloween stuff on any of the channel, like the streaming channels? I know Max, which is like HBO, um, HBO streaming service was, um, or is doing, uh, what are they calling it? Spooky something. Uh, I don't remember. <laughs> But I know, like, later this month, they're supposed to have the new M. Night Shyamalan movie, Trapped, or Trap, um, which I really want to see. And what else have I watched? Um, I've been watching the MGM series, which you can get on Amazon Prime if you subscribe to, like, MGM or if you have the MGM Plus already, um, the show called From, which is um, quite interesting. It's... Um, I like it, but I like all that kind of stuff. And then I just recently watched on Netflix Woman of the Hour, um, which is, I guess, Anna Kendrick. She's a girl from Pitch Perfect, those Pitch Perfect movies. Um, it's her first movie as a director, I think is what they were saying. It's on Netflix and it's about um, the dating game, the dating game show killers, what that he was a silly serial killer in like the 70s, 80s. And um, it's so it's based on true story. And it's uh, she, Anna Kendricks also plays the woman that was on the dating show game with him crazy stuff i yeah i couldn't believe like reading about it after the fact the fact that they didn't do any kind of background checks on the guys that were on the show it was crazy because he had already been in trouble prior to being on the show so yeah <laughs> but uh it was it was pretty it was pretty good the the movie she did a good job so let's see. Up next, we have a miscellaneous envelope, our acorn race. I forgot about our little squirrel buddies. I need a dice. And let's see. So number six is winning. We have number five in second place. Two and three are, are in third. And then one and four are not even in it. They are absent-mindedly looking for the nuts, I guess. I don't know <laughs> what's going on with them. Let's see if we can get them in the race at all. Nope, five. Five is blue. So, yeah, let me know in the comments down below if you're watching any kind of spooky stuff for October. Um, I know that there's like some other stuff that I, I want to check out Max again. I know Hulu does Huluween. I do want to watch um, 
they are they are doing a new season of um, American Horror Stories, which is different from American Horror Story. So, <laughs> if you follow American Horror Story at all, every season of American Horror Story has a different theme, but it's typically the same actors season after season it's just a different theme so like first season was murder house second season was asylum so same actors playing different characters completely different storyline storyline every season the way that they're doing american horror stories is every single episode might have some of the same actors but every single episode is its own story so there's no like theme for the whole entire season. Every I, I like it. Um Ryan Murphy, which I, I believe is the producer or director or whatever of American Horror Stories, American Horror Story, also has on FX, I believe, which is also on Hulu. Grotesqueries which I've seen the first couple of episodes. Truly, it looks like it could have been another season of American Horror Story, but it is its own, like, show, I guess. Um, and it's not, it's pretty good. It, another five. <laughs> All right, I'm putting that five back and taking the ten. So let me know. It's a little, like, uh, intense, grotesqueries. Um, Travis, Travis Kelsey is supposed to be in it if you follow like Taylor Swift and that whole thing at all. But I haven't, I haven't gotten that far to see like where he is in it. Sorry, my nose is itchy. Ooh. And I think I just shook the camera. <laughs> uh, I really want, uh, all right. I, I, I think after this one, I'm going to be done. I don't want six to win yet. I want, I want one or four to get in the race, <laughs> but I'm going to leave it off here. So another five and six. But um, yeah, let me know if you've been watching any of the like the different shows like that. Um, Niecy Nash is in Grotesqueries as well. She's doing really, really good. Um, but it's yeah, it's kind of it's kind of intense a little bit. I, I don't want to say graph. Well, maybe graphic, I guess. Yeah, let's go with graphic. Um, so if you don't like that kind of stuff, just skip it. <laughs> not that I, you know, not that I love that kind of stuff, but I don't know. I, I don't, I don't mind it. It's, I love the horror like genre all the way around. <laughs> I did watch the new Salem's Lot movie on Max. That was what I watched, which is Stephen King. And I love, love, love Stephen King. I actually just went to the bookstore recently and got like four more <laughs> books of his, two of his, two of his son's um, books, because his sons are both writers as well. And I just, he's my favorite. I, I, don't read like much of anything else these days. If I'm going to read, it's going to be read. It's going to be Stephen King, but, um, the movie was okay. Um, I think, I think there was like a series back in the day for Salem's lot that I thought was better than this movie. I feel like sometimes the movies just go too fast because they have a shorter amount of time to kind of tell the whole story. So, it just, it wasn't bad though. It was, it was all right. Three, let's do, and one. We'll just leave it there. So that's four. And let me put a dollar in and take a five. Poor decisions. This one's from Robin's Documented Life. And I'm sorry, did I say who like some of these other ones were? Oh, the autumn, the acorn race one is mine. That's one, that one is in the, uh, that's in the seasons of saving. So you would get one page of two challenges for each season. So there would be two challenges for spring, then summer, then winter, then fall or fall, then winter. You know what I mean? <laughs> uh. Okay, this is another one of mine, but this one's on the year of minis. 
and let's see pumpkins are four so let's finish that line off and I'm going to take out a one put in a five and we'll do an orangey color okay if there's any others I might go back to the winery one and maybe finish it I don't know. I'm going to need a Sharpie for this one. And let's see. I think I want to, do I want to finish this, like these two lines off since I have a little bit of extra? We one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, why not? Okay, so five going in. The Sharpies dry fast. So this one, sorry, this one is budgetyourlife.com. She has an Etsy and a YouTube. So go, I mean, not Etsy. Why do I always say that? She has a YouTube and that's her own website, budgetyourlife.com. Ugh. Okay, concerts. Ooh, let's finish this one. This is Oma Crafts and Budgets. So that is four, two, so that's six, five, and three. Ooh, the pen don't want to write. Okay, so four, six, 11, 14. Okay, so this one's going to concerts. And this has, this is going to be a random amount because then do it, uh, it's roll and save. I'm sure if you wanted to, you could designate each circle as a specific amount. Um, would, you know, do it any way you want. So 10, 10, 25, 35, 45, 46, 7, 8, 9, 50, 1, and 2. It's a good amount. I'm going to have to look into another concert soon. Okay, so we'll need another one for that envelope next up is casino and this one is d's plans and budgets it's um was monthly little minis that she did as well and um, let's do the two one and two this one's going to be a low amount i think I think all of the ones that she did in her set of minis were like $30 and under. We have a new one for travel. This one is budget for success and that's for F O U R. This one will be 60. Ooh, should we get this 10 out of the way? Why not? Let's do it. Okay, that's a good start to that one. And this one would go into travel when I'm finished. I don't have any plans for any kind of travel just yet. Uh, we're kind of recuperating from Aruba. This one, Snow Gardener Budgets. Snow Gardener 307 Budgets. <laughs> And this one is 40. This was from July. I believe she did like a Christmas in July theme. And let's do four. Two, three, and four to get this one started. And maybe we'll do all Christmas colors on this one. <laughs> okay and then we are are we back at 
the Lizen Less. We are. Let's see, I've got five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. Uh, let's see. Well, let's do the let's do another five because there's a few fives on here. There's one more after this. And then I'm going to let that dry and I'm going to get a new challenge for this giveaway envelope. Okay, I found this one in my little stash of challenges and thought that this would be fun to do. It's I spy something. So it says find what you spy and count how many letters are in the word and save that amount. And this one is by Cute Budgets. She has a Ko-Fi, I believe, and a YouTube. So go check her out. So let's see. What do we spy? <laughs> Um, let's see, I, well, let's, I guess maybe we start at the top and work our way down. I spy something long, long, um, hmm, long, <laughs> um, I'm just looking around my room to see like, what do I have in my room? that is long. You know what I do have? I do have a mirror hanging on the wall by the door of my bedroom. And it's one of those like long, uh, like full length mirrors. So you can kind of see what you look like after you get dressed. So we're going to do mirror. So that would be one, two, three, four, five, six dollars. One, two, three, four, five, six dollars. Cool. So this ought to be fun. <laughs> okay. Okay. So I think I'm going to put, I only have $2 left. I'm going to put my little paper clip there, but let me see. Let's go back to this one. I have $2 left. So we're going to put the $2 in here. I just don't want to deal with an IOU on the scratch-offs. So, you know, it is what it is. All right, should we do some J-Bucks today? Let's get this money um, for the ones that we finished put into the Soul Mama binder first. Okay. All right, so I have two challenges finished. I did... Um, get this I was gonna say paper clip that's not a paper clip keychain <laughs> wow <laughs> I got this keychain of course in Aruba but he's a little turtle and he's so cute I love that he's got like a front and a back that are both like colorful and beautiful and he's he's thick too he, that's that's a thick uh keychain but uh, let's get into this. Now, this is a Soul Mama binder. She is on has a shop on Amazon, uh, so go check her out. She has all sorts of different kinds of binders. So this one is for concerts. That one's for giveaways. Let's see what we get to first. Okay, we have concerts. So concerts is getting an extra 52. So concerts should now have 62, 10, 20, 35, 45, 55, 56, 7, 8, 9, 60, 1, and 2. So that could be enough for a concert ticket somewhere. Next up is giveaways. Oh, and I do still have the money in here. This is just designating or representing what is in the high yield savings account still. I haven't transferred the money over yet to start paying stuff off, but I do need to do that soon. So that will probably get emptied out. And then let's see, giveaways is getting the 25, right? 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yep. 
Okay, so... 20, 40, 65, 75, 85, 90, 95, 100, and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I don't know why I felt like that was, like, weird. Counted weird. All right, so... Maybe, um, I have to take a look at my subscriber count. I'm not entirely sure where I am uh, currently, but um, maybe the next milestone that I hit will have to do another giveaway. Uh, let's see. This video is not too, too long, and I can probably shorten it a little bit. So let's do some J-Bucks. I have a ton of J-Bucks in here currently. I have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and 100, and 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 65, 75, 80, 80, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90, 1, 2, 3, 293 dollars in J bucks currently. Insanity. I don't know how I ended up with this much. I, I mean, I know I haven't really been doing this stuff I I got paid while we were away so like I pulled that money out of the bank but yeah it's been taking me a little while to kind of get back into doing the challenges and whatnot so members chose the book for me um they were undecided between I had two votes for life's beach and two votes for the Liz and Les sticker book challenge so I put the two into like a wheel picker thing and this is the one that won so I'm happy <laughs> so let's see I was doing the roll and save oh and I was doing because I have like some bigger numbers on here I was doing a bigger dice was I doing this one I think so let's see what shenanigans we get into today. I do have the envelope in my big savings challenge book, which I, I need to do some more of those challenges too, because I haven't in a little while, but let's see what we get today. That's an eight. Let's see. That's a one. So we're up to nine. Another eight. So 17. Three. So we're up to 20. I'm just going to pull the 20 out so I don't have anything smaller than 10. So. And that would be a nine. I'm going to do it with the dot at the bottom. So, wow. Five, six, seven, eight, and nine. So today we have 29 going in. I was just counting it up here to make sure I have the same amount. So 10, 25, 26, 7, 8, and 9. Should I do any more since I have like so much money here? I, I want to kind of do it page by page. So I haven't started anything in any of the other pages yet. I kind of want to do like, like I said, page by page. Um, let me pull out a different color here. We'll do green. Let's do the next roll. That's a seven. And a five. So we're up to 12. A four. 16 we're up to. Woo! And there goes the dice. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, there we go fell all the way onto the floor like on the back <laughs> in the wall over there oof a 12 goodness and one more another four okay so we have let's see 20 25 
32. Let me just double check that math because I don't know if my math is math and 32. I did good. Math is not my strong point. So, wow. 32 for one line. Whew. And I think we'll call it there for the day. So it's probably going to take me a little bit longer depending on like how long this money kind of lasts to um, do this whole challenge book. I don't really know what I'm going to do with the money once I'm done, but there's, I mean, there's a good amount of challenges in here. So um, I don't believe like all of these would be huge amounts for something like a day at the race. I'd probably do... Um, until one wins like this one 65 I think that this will end up being more than the little June mystery binder was but um, we will see I guess so I have this envelope all the way in the back she does send the dashboard with it so I'm going, I am going to sort the money, but no, oh, I don't really have to very much. All right. So that's that. I will do those savings challenges again soon. I promise. Um, I think I'm going to not really like back away from doing them every single Saturday. Um, I just like, I kind of feel like there's other videos that I end up wanting to do that kind of get pushed to, um, the wayside, or I don't really know like what kind of days to, um, to do them because of like the, the schedule that I've kind of had. But, um, I want to try to do, I think, the savings challenges maybe like twice a month with maybe a little bit of a bigger amount of money. And we'll see how that goes. But I do have some bigger challenges that I also want to try to do. I think I'm going to start that 2025 challenge from um, an or almost organized owl and the new car savings challenge that I have in there as well. So the, those are some bigger amounts that are like would be going into those. So it is what it is. I don't know. You let me know what you think till next time. Bye for now.